Welcome back to Power Lunch for a Thursday, everybody. I'm Bill Griffith. The U.S. Golf Open continues in Farmingdale, New York today. We're going to look at a new book. It's fascinating, actually, uh, whether or not you can use a rather famous business improvement strategy called Six Sigma to improve your golf game. As you see, the U.S. Open is underway in Farmingdale, New York today. And since we figured a lot of uh, golfers are thinking about that at the moment, they're also business people. Our research shows a lot of you out there who watch us are golfers, in addition to being business people. Uh, we found a fascinating book that brings the two of them together. It's called Wisdom on the Green. It looks at the correlation between golf and work, offering up a guide of sorts on how to improve both using the management strategy near and dear to our heart around here, known as Six Sigma. Joining us from Austin, Texas, is the co-author of the book, Forrest uh, Brayfoyle. Good to see you. Thank you for joining us today. Thank you, Bill. Give me 30 seconds on Six Sigma, first of all, if, well, that's, think, if that's possible. <laughs> well, I'll try. I think one of the fundamental things we uh, do within our lives is processes. You know, whether we're getting ready for work and or we're doing some things in business or playing golf for that matter. So we have activities in our life that's our processes and these processes have outputs and these outputs can be very important to the business for the success of the business or for success of our golf game. And, and Six Sigma is all about reducing the number of mistakes in the process so that we improve our output. I mean, that in a nutshell is what Six Sigma is all about, right? That's one of the traditional ways that Six Sigma is viewed. In fact, Motorola started or invented Six Sigma in the mid 80s and GE uh, took it to new heights when yes. they aligned their activities to business needs. Now, and, and now you're taking it to golf. You're, you, can we use Six Sigma? to improve our golf game? That's the well, question. That's the uh, point on uh, the, the other point. What we're doing with what we call smarter Six Sigma solutions is taking it to new heights because it's a lot more than just mistakes. The Six Sigma involves looking at the input variables that affect our output variables and those are what we want to control. And uh, we also want to improve how we do things. So the bottom line is that we want to improve our outputs. And this could be looking at defects or it could be how we actually do things. It could be right. the flow of things. But you know, Forrest, I mean, we're all told. I mean, uh, my swing thoughts are complicated enough as it is when I'm swinging a golf club, and uh, Fred Couple says you shouldn't think about anything when you're swinging a golf club. So is there a way I can do that and still apply Six Sigma to all of this? Well, yes, I think the one of it is how we play the course. It's not just our strokes, but also how we play the course. Like Tiger Woods, he's done an excellent job on how he plays the course. Right. I mean, for and him, he says, it's the old Ben Hogan line, it's, it's, it's about minimizing mistakes. You're going to make mistakes, but it's a way of minimizing those mistakes that uh, is the guy who usually wins. And it's how you play the course. Yeah. In, if you get in a bad condition and you're trying to hit between two trees and the chances for your level of golf is only one in 10 of actually getting between those trees, it's probably a good idea to chip it on the fairway. In the end, you would have a better score basically you're playing the, car, or the course a lot better. And this is kind of what we describe right. in our book, uh, Wisdom on the Green, Smarter Six Sigma. I can imagine you're a black belt in Six Sigma. What's your handicap? Oh, my handicap is not as good as I'd like it to be. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's, that's how it usually works. <laughs> Forrest, thanks for joining us. Appreciate it. Forrest uh, Brave Foyle, his uh, book, he's the co-author of the book, Wisdom on the Green, Smarter Six Sigma Business Solutions.